to make one of my favorite salads and my salads usually have an array of ingredients. You currently have six ingredients in front of you. <laughs> so I have mixed uh, green vegetables, mixed green vegetables. I have some octopus or some protein. I have some nuts for the crunch. I have some fruit for the sweets. I have some cheese because I like cheese. And I have some tomatoes for color. So I'm going to wash these now. I'm gonna wash this <laughs> and this and this and then I'll be right back. So the first thing I'm adding to my salad is my greens. Very simple, just put them in the plate. <laughs> That's it, put them in the plate. All right. After that, I move them around so it can be any shape or look I want. In this case, I'm going with a round one. Then, I add my protein, this is from the sea, in the center, all right, and I think this looks pretty good and you can just start to indulge, but I won't, I go a step further, I add my tomatoes and I add my grapes, all right. You can set these out any way you want to set them out. There is no particular way to set them out. But of course, if you're serving it to, you know, guests or so, try and make it as pretty as possible or as, what's that word? Attractive, that's the one. Try and make it as attractive as possible. All right. Then I'm going to add my nuts. <laughs> Any nuts will do, almond if that's what you like, and all I do is hold them in my hand, crush them, and put them in. That's it. Because right now they are too big, so I just crush them and sprinkle them all over the salad. Make sure that your hands are clean, and of course, as much as you want to put, you can, depending on how crunchy you want yours to be. I love when my salad has many flavors, hence my salad has many flavors. <laughs> All right, so the next thing I'm going to do is cut my cheese. Then you place your cheese nicely, gently, anywhere you want to put it on the salad. Nothing specific, no specific place, just anywhere you want to put it. All right. And then finally, I'm going to add some garnish. <laughs> I know it's already pretty in terms of the color coordination and so, but I'm going to add my secret ingredient to my salad, which is some mint. I'm going to cut it very small and sprinkle it all over the salad. And that is what's going to give it a very unique flavor. I should tell you that I don't use dressing on my salad. I just make it fancy enough where I don't need dressing at all. A very easy random way to get the mint all over the, um, the salad is just just get a scissors and a dinner scissors and cut it over it it will just fall in random places or you can just move your hand around while you're cutting it so it does fall in random places all right just cut it as small as possible so that the taste can be all over the salad all right so what I'm trying to do is have salads in the evening as opposed to a heavy meal and that's basically it for my salad 